checking this program out. But think that both of you are totally. I want to read. I want to read. Man, man, she's a, hot. A statistic. They say a statistic on a show like this. Yeah, here's a statistic for you. The death rate here on Earth Come on, is 100. Bitch, rematch me. And we're not getting that as a lot. Very okay? accurate. We're not getting that as a lot. Rematch. Even at its most, it's not going to last but, but 70, Fucking 80 cunt. years, maybe 90, maybe 100. So, you know there's got to be something better than this, and I have good news. There Rematch is. me, yeah. bitch. And you can go there. There is a way prepared for you to have a better life than the one you've ever had here. And Jesus is the way with his own followers. After following him around for three and a half years, listening to all that Jesus said and watching what he did, Thomas still asked... How do I go to heaven? And Jesus responded, I am the way, the truth, and the life. If you want to go to the Father, you're going to have to go through Jesus the Son. And that was Jesus talking. So it is more real than this. Everything I saw there was more real than this. And I, I know how it, I mean, that was more real than yeah. this is because this won't last. Okay, wait. Both of you have said that. How do you get more real than I'm here, I can feel, touch? People ask me, was it like a dream? And I said, no, God this is a dream. It pisses me off. You know, you know this uh, unreal game. quality to a dream. Like sometimes when you're dreaming, you're going, this is a weird dream. I think I want to wake up now. Right. You, know? Yes. I mean, you know that That's the dream so, you is an illusion. Bitch. Um, the near death. Okay, experience. I'll take your fucking Your, your nut, senses, nut, your you understanding, your comprehension is all so much heightened. Yeah. So you can taste more, see more, feel more, hear more, yeah. know more. Yeah. You're just like... See, it's so much more intense. You're going like life is like a dream compared. This, this doesn't seem real. Yeah, this doesn't seem real now compared to that. When you've been there, yeah, then you know that this is temporal. This is yeah. fleeting. This won't last. Help yeah. me understand that because Don, if I, uh, you know, I'm sitting next to you and I and I do this, right? The every part of your brain told you that I'm real. Yes. Okay. So help me understand what you mean by. This isn't real, and that was real. Oh, okay. so we know bitch. that we are going Fuck to die. You. I already established that earlier. And when we do, the, the earthly vessel that we inhabit is going to decay. It will cease to I exist. I better bring my whore down the safety. I mean, found, I've had 34 operations to try to put me back together again. They had to reattach things, arms and legs. And, and I have the scars to show for it. If an archaeologist oh, found my body five hundred years me from now, they think they found the missing link, because I've been re -put, <laughs> put back together again. But you know what? Even that body will be fleeting someday. In heaven, in hell, it never dies. It never is fleeting. It never decays. It will never eventually disappear. It is an eternal place, and this is not eternal. And that is reality, and that is where we're going, the, one of those places, and this is not. Okay. Your turn. Um, if you just tuned in, we're sitting with Don Piper, Reverend Howard Storm. Don... Uh, went to heaven when he died, was hit by a truck, and then what was your condition again? You just, you, oh, you had, had a, a perforation of the stomach. Yeah, you had a, you had oh, a. Oh no! Hell no! You ain't gonna pull wand, that shit on me. I think on is them. what you said. And and um, wait, uh, okay, it just, the 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 reality thing. This is not real, and what you experienced was real. Help me well, add to what Don just said. I'm a big living dog shit. Out right of me. now, this is what we know. This is Fucking our cunt. measure of what is true, what is real. But the fact of the matter is, is that we were created by God to be spiritual beings. We, our purpose is to be with God forever. That's what God created us for and what God wants. Okay. To live with God forever as spiritual beings. So God, in His infinite God wisdom, has it. given us this experience of the physical world to prepare us to choose what we want to do for eternity. And it's our choice. You know, God is not in the punishment business. No. God is in the love business. People yeah. choose hell. Millions of people are going to hell God because is in the punishment they refuse business. to love God. Yeah. They reject God. Okay. And, it's, and it's horrible. And that's why I'm no. here. That's why no. I came here tonight to the other side of the United States Fucking to tell people pony. to choose God. Okay. How, how did... How did that change your life? When you came oh, back into your body, what was the... 
everything. And I was, I was, I wept for days and weeks because I was like, okay, where am I going to begin oh, rebuilding no. my life? I, Hell you know, no, you okay, ain't I got to give up the booze. Shit. I got to give up the cigarettes. I got to give up the womanizing. I got to give up the lying. I got to give up the, the pursuit of Fuck power. Off. I got to give Come up the, the need for fame. You know, I, on and on and on and on and control, you know, and raging and stuff oh, like all that stuff's got to go. Where do I begin? How do I love people? I started, everybody I've met, I'm sick in the hospital, really, really sick. And everyone I met, I'm like, I love you. I, Jesus, Jesus. Oh, go fuck yourself. And, like, and they're going like, back, 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 go away, go away. You know, fuck and, off, and, yeah. and then when I got my eyesight back and started reading them, because I lost my eyesight, so when I got my eyesight and started reading the Bible, then I became a Bible-thumping zealot, and I lost everybody, everybody in the world, you know, drive, because I would, I would thunder read the Bible, and I figured if they wouldn't believe me, if I read the Bible loud enough and strong enough, you know, and I had a pretty big voice as a teacher, you know, I could get it through them, it didn't work, worked out wow. real bad, turned wow. everybody off, and it was church, it was that church, you know, um, helping the uh, oh, teenagers, oh no, hell no, you ain't doing that shit, like that, and um, participating in worship, and I'm taking the kids on uh, camping trips and stuff like that where I started working on the Stupid super fucker. And it's, it's like living it, not preaching it. So you you came out, you were agnostic, you have your d near death, or you died and yeah. taken to hell, and you come back. Did you know that Jesus, I mean, did you have enough knowledge that, or well, did you go to a church further, and get saved? Further in the experience, or? I called on him, and he came and took me out he's of that. Got, he's got me in a bad re position. my whole wow. life. Okay, so here's 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 a good question. Okay, Don, we know why. Ooh, it to you. I'm gonna story. ask you. Up. Why do you think that 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 happened to you? You know, I uh, was in a hospital bed for 13 months. Oh, you uh, get rid of that lost fucking Lost my arms pain. and legs, and and they didn't. Oh think I would no, walk hell again. no, you ain't doing that fucking shit. Well, then I would shit. ever have the use of um, the arm. You that suck my ass. The, this arm while I'm in the back seat of the car. Um, I, I asked myself, Bitch. lying flat on my back all those months, you know why? I was on my way to church to lead a Bible study. Yeah. Well, you know, I wasn't in the wrong why place. Me? Yeah, yeah, why? Why me? And, and 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 this year, I think I have a better answer than I did twenty Suck years ago. Suck my and ass! And it's it's something I can tell people heaven is real. Yeah, and then you can go there. Yeah. it's a real place, and more real than this. I mean, there are gates. Uh, there is a street made of gold. There are incredible oh my uh, structures, God, very ornate and very elaborate. Home. There is a hill high and lifted up. At the pinnacle of that hill is the brightest light of all, because. Lord God is there, and what I wanted to do is go through the gates of the street and fall at his feet and say thank you for letting me be here. That's how real heaven is. So, I know now the reason that I came back is to tell people heaven is real and that Jesus is the way. You can go there through Christ. And that's what we're. That's what we want to do. That's why we're still here. We're here to help everyone else get there. Reverend that's Storm, it. you uh, you are the what you used to be was someone that uh, would have tuned into a program like this and said, "Okay, everyone in the audience, that's all you know, made up." These stories are made up. You're trying to get ratings. Is that how you would have perceived it, or would you, you have just said everyone on that set and everyone in that studio are crazy? How, how would you have how would you have perceived this I, program? I know that there is an interest in God in everyone, even if they say they don't believe in God. even with you. Yeah. Before and that, the event, and there's a battle going on, a raging on inside of them. But I want I want to say something that in response to this. Right don't believe you, don't believe Don, don't believe me, don't believe TBN, don't believe the church. Go to the source. If you go to the source, if you say, Jesus, I need you. I've never believed in you and I don't know if you're Think real. Long, but Jesus, fucking wrong. I need to know if you're real. Will you come into my life? Oh my if God. And if you mean it from your heart, and if you sit there damn. and wait, and don't get all frustrated and get impatient and stuff like that, but just say, Jesus, Jesus, please come into my life. I've been a rotten person. God, and I don't know why you touch a piece of filth like me, but please, Jesus, come into my life, which is what I did. Why don't these people, people rematch me? You know, it may not be...